Hey everybody, I'm Ted from Tabex. In this tutorial, we are looking at delivering license keys. The license key deliverable is available for any Tabex store type, but your first consideration should be what store type am I using? If you want to deliver license keys alongside in-game commands, of course, you would have to choose the same game as your server. For example, Minecraft, you have to log in with your Minecraft username. For Rust, this is a Steam login. And for 5M, this is a CFX account. Depending on the store type, you will have a different kind of login system. It is also possible to have no login system. So if your main focus is license keys, I would recommend choosing the middle option, monetize my game or website. If you also have a Discord community, you might also want to think about the right option. But if you choose the right option, people have to log in with Discord. This might not be something you want if your main focus is delivering license keys for your software. So once we are at our dashboard, let's go to packages and then let's add a new package. Then after filling in the basic information, let's scroll down and let's focus on the license key deliverable. It says, send a license key to your customer when they purchase this package. Upload a CSV of license keys to get started. So let's first of all, take a look at the template. This is the format that is required. So I just made a few changes and then saved it as number two. You can have up to 500 keys in one file. So let's click on upload and then locate our file. And then as you can see, those keys will automatically attach to this package. So we can now see our active keys. Let's click on update. So let's add the package to our basket and then let's complete the checkout. During the checkout, the customer will provide their email address. This is where the license key will be sent to. As you can see, this field is required. So I will fill in my information and then complete the order. And then our order is complete. So now let's check our email. Please find the link to your license key you have purchased below. So we can then refill the license key. We get the same message, we get our key. So in our case, this was key one. We can copy the key from here. Of course, if this is a longer key, this is pretty helpful. And it also tells your customer your support email. So if they have any issues, they should be able to find you. If we now go back to our package and click on edit, you can see key one purchased, and then it says the date and the exact time. And from here, we can even view the exact payment. You can also find this information the other way around. If we go to payments and view my payment, when scrolling down, you can also see the exact license key that we got. And again, the exact moment that we got it. I will also link to this page with more information about license keys. As a quick note, the file can hold up to 500 licenses at once. If your customers contact you saying that they can't find the email, make sure that they search for Tabex because it might have gone to their spam or any junk folders. I will link to any help pages in the video description so you can always find the most up-to-date information. I hope this was helpful. If anything is still unclear, feel free to leave a comment down below. As always, thank you for watching and good luck with your Tabex store.